hello guys welcome back so in this video you will learn how you can ask for the permission that is allow the user for using the location of the phone so once the user allow the permission then we can display the live location of the user so for that purpose in order to ask for the permission we have to go to the postpack.html we will add the dependency and it is by the name permission handler okay then click pub get so it has been added successfully as you can see that now using this package permission handler using this dependency uh, we are going to now ask for the permission that is we will write the implementation code so go to the main dot dot and inside our main dot dot inside the main after the firebase dot initialize app we can implement we can say wet permission dot location and we will proceed this one that is location when in use that is when the app is in use then we want to use the location of the device that is the user location we want so we will say that if it is not granted that is if it is denied okay if the location permission is denied then we will ask for the permission so we can say dot then value if now this uh, lo location permission if it is denied okay if it is denied then this value has a value true otherwise if it is not denied then the value will have the value will have the value false so we can say value of permission actually this is okay that is if it is denied it will be equals to true so we can say value of permission if it is true then it means that permission is denied and we have to request the permission so we can say permission dot permission dot location when in use we ask for the permission that is when the app is in use ask for the uh, location that time that is we want to access the location when the user is using the app so we can request the permission for it then after it we have to go to the android app src man android manifest.xml and here we have to add the location permission that is uses permission so you can above the application you can say uses permission android name equals to android dot permission dot access underscore fine location okay this one access underscore fine location and then we have to write this inside the double quotes okay just like this inside the double quotes you can write that and then we can add the closing tag similarly one more we will add and that will be the axis course location so we can just say axis course location okay c o a r s e so let's just type it quickly okay axis course location so now we are good to go let's test our application here we go you can see the permission allow user app to access this device location so we can say while using the app so the permission is granted now how we, we will know for example if I install the app again that is close the app and run the app again then it will not ask me for the permission again because the permission is already granted